All right, so the date is April 26th. I believe this might be my second or third video that I've done for the day so far. So what I did know was that, um, actually, this might be, I have a couple, a couple more things to show. So um, the first thing that I did was for um, one of the quest NPCs, Little Lucy, her quest is that she lose her balloon. So I created this balloon asset. I got it from an assets pack that had a whole cluster balloon, so I had to unpack the prefab completely, and then um, just get this specific uh, rope and balloon, um, put the respective material on the rope, put the respective material on the uh, balloon, and then change the color, and then uh, prefab them together so they can move as one. So all this has to happen now is just link its link to her request, and then the next substantial thing that I did was that I added um, a control screen. So what happened basically is that the player will be able to press uh, C. Well, it should be C, because let me actually gonna fix this live. Because what happened before is that I made this a settings screen and not a control screen. Obviously, controls not start with S, so C, there you go, is a control screen. All right, so, Nice, so I'm gonna let that finish reload the script. Okay, boom, right now. So once you press C, the control screen will pop up. So let me run the game and show what it looks like. So you can run the game. When you press C, controls. Use the left mouse button to move around. Press I to open the inventory. Press J to open your quest journal. And lastly, press M to open the overhead map. So as you know, I can press C, on, off, on, off. As you see, I'm using my mouse to move around. Press I to open the inventory, press J to open the quest journal and to view everyone's quest, and then of course I could press M to open the overhead map. Yep, everything looks good, and everything looks good. Controls are in place. Um, this is created in Canva, just a PNG. Um, I guess when I try to remove the background, it looks like this. I can make this easier by just maybe changing the font to look, uh, to look um, a bit better, because basically it's here. I was using this. Hopefully, um, OBS is showing. I could just, if I would like, I could change the font to something that won't have as much white space. So obviously, when you export it, uh, transparency. Yeah, when you when you export it as a PNG, it's it's um gonna show up. Um, what you got? It's 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 it's, it's gonna show up white. Let's see. I could. I uh, yeah. I can't even uh delete the background. So. Yep, so that's basically what we have so far. We got a quest, uh, we got not a quest, but we got the, the control screen up and running, and then little Lucy now has a balloon. And this so the balloon looks in person. Let me run, 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 run. Uh, where did I even put the balloon? There it is. So look how the balloon, the balloon looks. Looks pretty good. And I'll always press C. To open the control screen so yep added and fully functional